Hi guys, it's me Megan Hashem and today I'm doing a supplement review on one of my very favorite supplements and that is black seed oil. Black seed oil. Black seed, black seed oil. Black seed oil is really a secret Arabic remedy for everything. So my Arabic in-laws have told me many times to take this. I haven't listened to them because it was in my kitchen and it smelled so bad. <laughs> it was just so strong. I've since learned to love the flavor of it actually. Well, not love it, but not hate it, not be like off put by it. So it's actually got a really cool flavor once you get used to it. It's just very, very strong. So it takes a little getting used to. Um, you can smell it coming out of the bottle, all in the cupboard. That used to bother me, but now that it's helped me so much, it actually doesn't anymore. It is an acquired taste for sure. It's kind of like apple cider vinegar or any of those things. You kind of like, you might not like at the start, but then you get used to and crave and love. So black seed oil basically is one of those things that does everything for everything. Like, why wouldn't everyone take it? It's like green tea. It's like apple cider vinegar. It's like CBD oil. All these things, people say that they, they do everything from cancer to weight loss to everything, colds. Um, this is one of those. Okay, so I always love those. I might do a video on all those things that, that you know, you hear do everything. So why wouldn't we all just be taking them? So it's one of those, the blessed seed. It has a rich history. It was talked about in all the main religions, how it cures all these things. Uh, it was found in King Tut's tomb. So going back to ancient Egypt, it was being used for all its medicinal purposes. It's indigenous to the Mediterranean area, the Middle East, all that kind of area. That's where it's grown and um, people even use it to cook sometimes, the black seed, not the oil, but the black seeds. They toss it in their food as a little, you know, different spice to their food. So you can try that out. I've never tried that yet. Maybe I should. You can either order this online, get it at an Arabic store, like an Arabic grocery store, or I'm not sure if it's anywhere else. Maybe health food stores probably have it. Um, it's known as black seed oil, agella, sativa, black cumin seed oil, kalonji oil. There's lots of different names for it, but usually it's black seed oil. This doesn't even say, oh, I guess it's in French it says oil of the nigella grains I guess that's how it would be um, translated here my Arabic in-laws got me this one um, they usually supply my black seed oil addiction so you know it's said to treat everything basically diabetes heart problems obesity cancer but one of the big main things that everyone tells me and I, I took it for and it changed my idea of it definitely was nasal problems and coughs. So I had a cough and it lasted maybe three months this past winter. The cough just never left. And I have this issue often, like I'm kind of prone to respiratory issues. That's my my kind of problem usually. Um, so I got this cough and it wouldn't leave. It was like two and a half, three months. It was still there. And you know what? My in-laws told me, take the black seed oil. And I was like, oh, the smell. Oh my goodness. I mean, when you smell, it's pretty strong. It's like a spicy, peppery smelling, I don't know, um, really, really um, strong smell and I thought oh my god I had taken Buckley's I didn't mind whatever I take all this gross stuff it doesn't matter but this was like a little much in my mind for me I ended up taking it and it was magical I don't know I don't know if it was this or I just got better but after three months of coughing I took this for a few days and I was the cough started going less and less and it finally left me. So I am definitely a convert. I love the black seed oil. I'm telling everyone about it. My mom got sick in the winter too and I told her take the black seed oil. I ordered it for her on Amazon and had it delivered to her. I 
totally think it's good. I think it's an amazing thing. I'm gonna take some right now. I take a, a tablespoon and I just pour the oil on there. You'll see it's, it's kind of like an amber co colored oil. And I just pop that in my mouth. And it's an oil, so it co I don't even need to take a glass of water, see? But I will. <laughs> Stays with you, that taste, because it is an oil. So what I was told was when I had the throat and the cough issues, I was told like, don't quickly take a glass of water, even though it tastes like Wah! in there, and it tastes like oil, right, in your mouth. Don't take the water right away because you want it to coat your throat if it's for like a, a cold or something like that. It doesn't go away though because it's like oily in there and my breath is like fire right now. It is a very strong smell and taste. Woo! But once you get used to it, it's okay. People even say you can rub this on scars or burns or you know rashes or problems and it will help externally as well so that's cool I've never tried that I might one day when I need to uh, it says it's good for arthritis nasal inflammation diabetes asthma obesity high blood pressure digestive disorders inflammation fights infection it can be put on the skin topically um, oh yeah, it's good for your hair. You're supposed to massage it into your scalp for hair regrowth. Um, it's good for acne. It's good for dry hair. I guess you can put it through your hair also to make your hair nice and, and uh, you know, healthy. I haven't tried that yet. I might. That, that might be cool, but it would smell very strong, so I'm not sure. Um, good for dry skin. It's good good for a lot so definitely try it out if you haven't you can also buy it in capsule form I don't believe that's as good probably I like taking the pure oil some people take it every day day and night some people say more research needs to be done and they're not sure if you should just take it for a prolonged amount of time um, so some people just do it when they're sick or have a, a problem that they want it to solve uh, that's kind of what I kind of do half and half I kind of think you should take it every day but I haven't taken it every day for a prolonged amount of time so just do your research check it out black seed oil is amazing if you're having any of these issues pretty much any issue try it out see if it helps with whatever ails you and uh, yeah hope you enjoy it if you enjoyed this video make sure to share like and subscribe to my channel I do lots of supplement reviews fitness videos motivational videos all that good stuff stay tuned for more talk soon <laughs>